Hello there, James M6PCG here. Um, today I'm going to be doing a review on the H777 radio and I'm going to be doing a comparison test with the VHF versus the UHF frequencies. Uh, for that test I'm going to be using the, the Wuxon radio which I've done a, a video on previously and we're going to be just seeing which is better for this sort of range and distance we're using. We're out in Canic Chase today, lovely day, and we're going to be, uh, well I'll drop Jim off quite a few miles away it's difficult to say exactly how far away he is, but the mere fact that we're going to have the same radios on different bands, you'll see which is clearer anyway. So I'll just give him a shout. James, are you there? Yes, we're seeing loud and clear. Okay, just stay still where you are for a second so you don't go any further away. Um, as you can see, we're currently using... Uh, shall do. Uh, we're currently using the, uh, the UHF uh, frequency band at the moment. So we're going to do a quick test on the UHF, see how clear it is, a bit of talking, and then using the same radios, we'll be doing the VHF. Okay, James, we're now recording this video. Uh, we're on the UHF band. Could you give me a bit of a talk and tell me about the quality of the call and what you think of it so far? Hopefully you should be able to pick all this up in my microphone. Yes, I can. Uh, it was very clear on. I'd suggest that I've gone down a massive hill since then. Not quite as good as it was, but I'd probably suggest it's just further down than I was, so a long way down, but other than that, it does seem to be clear. Okay, I've had to move my radio around a few times to uh, try and get your signal because it did drop out a bit. Um, so that's what I've had to do. Um, but apart from that, when you are coming through, you, you seem to be working okay. Is that the same with yourself? Yes, yes. Wonderful. Okay, so we're on UCH6 at the moment. Let's go to a VHF channel. Can we try um, uh, the, the VHF channel 1? We can. Stand by. Okay, so I've got these programmed already. So I just need to select... Uh, gone the wrong way. VHF channel 1, there we go. And this is now VHF, but he's in the same location using the same radio. James, do you copy? <coughs> James, do you copy? It'll probably take him a little bit longer to know how to figure out how to use this radio. <coughs> so bear with me. Jim, are you there? Okay, as a backup radio, we have got the MyTex handy in case this sort of thing happened. Jim, do you copy? Yes, yes. Copy. <clears throat> okay, just about got you there, Jim. It's not quite as good though. How am I coming through to you? Jim, are you there? I'm not picking you up now. I'll try again. Three or four times I've tried to... Uh, yeah, ...and uh, not pick me up. Are you picking me up now? OK, I've got you now. Can you hear me now? Yes, yes. I'm uh, very broken, I'm afraid. OK, fair enough. Just go back to um, the last channel we're on. The uh, UHF, UHF channel one. <clears throat> right, so that clearly wasn't very good. Okay, so on the UHF channels again now. James, do you copy? <clears throat> yes, James, I can hear you now. Can you hear me okay? Yes, yes, can hear you much better now, mate. Okay, so just to confirm, you've not moved, you're in the same place as you were on our last call on VHF, and we are using the same radios. <clears throat> yes, yes, everything is the same, other than... Okay, so clearly UHF is a lot stronger uh, and a lot better in these sort of open air conditions. I think that's safe to say, isn't it? <clears throat> yes, yes, a lot better. When we was on VHF, I tried to call at least four or five times, and I don't think you even picked me up. Lovely jubbly. Okay, Jim, um, whilst we've got you on the air, if you just stay there then, we're going to just try the H777s. <clears throat> okay. Okay, so the H777s, uh, this is the one I showed you yesterday. Right. Don't know that 
was. Jim, do you copy? Yes, sir. Okay, James, just give me a count uh, one to five, please. I didn't get all that from the phrase. Go ahead with your message again. Yeah, just give me a count one to five, please. No problem at all. One, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, <clears> two, one. Wonderful, thank you. Okay, just stand by. Okay, so using even the smaller radio with the smaller antenna um, on the... Yes, yes, sir. Uh, thank you for that. Just stand by. Just using the smaller radio with the smaller antenna, as you can see, it still works better on UHF than the VHF radios. So that's an interesting point there. Um, just to go back to what I was saying a short while ago, for a backup, in case we did lose touch, I've got the faithful Mitex radios with us, which uh, we've, we've got, which I've done a, a, um, a channel on before. Um, so these are, are still quite good. I'll just make sure this is still working. James, I'm just calling you on the MyTex now. Can you copy on the MyTex? The sword on channel one now on the MyTex. So you want to speak on the MyTex? Yes, yes, just go up to channel two on this one, mate. Are you there? Jim, do you copy? Okay. I didn't actually tell him how to change the channels on the mic tech, so I think I've lost him. James, are you there? James, are you there? I've lost him now. James, do you copy? James, are you there? Okay. So we've lost him. We have got quite a distance between us. The radios, I think, I've been able to do quite a good demonstration for you. Um, James, do you copy? So I think we've proved that in these sort of surroundings, UHF seems to be better than VHF. Okay, Jim, just stand by. Just rolling up the video. It's all good fun, isn't it? Um, the audio on this one, um, <clears throat> in the past, I found it quite sort of digitised or synthesised. Um, and it, it is still quite background noise with these radios. Obviously, you're going to get what you pay for at the end of the day. And the MyTech radios, which are a lot clearer, you know, you paid a lot more money for those. But still, these are still getting the range that I sort of expected and wanted. If not, a little bit better than I thought they would do. So all in all, from what I said yesterday in the demonstration today, they work and they do do the job. You can communicate better with this, even over a set of VHF radios. So I think that's concluded quite nicely. Um, any questions or any comments, please feel free to add them. And um, watch out for the next video. Okay, thanks for watching.